Hi everybody, welcome to another tutorial on Tal Uno LX V2. In this video I'd like to show you how you can quickly create a patch, in particular a pad patch, using this amazing synth. Um, I'm going to do this in AUM because I want to use also a reverb effect. So let's create first of all an audio channel. Let's uh, click on the plus sign, scroll down, type U space, here we go, Taluna LX V2. Then let's click to add uh, also a auto unit extension, extension for an effect, and let's scroll down to Fub Filter Pro R for reverb. Let's open that, and uh, yeah, I'm fine, I will leave the default settings for uh, this tutorial. So let's open up um, Taluno LX and also let's open up the keyboard. Let's link the keyboard in of AUM to Taluno LX V2. Okay, let's test it. Great. So we expanded a little bit. Okay, as you can hear, we have a default or startup preset. Okay, so here is what I would do to create a pad patch or preset. In this case, I don't want to use the so to wave, so I disable that. But I like to use uh, the pulse width uh, modulation, so I enable that. And I set it also to receive, uh, uh, to be modulated by the LFO. <laughs> As I do the changes, I will click also, I will press some of the keys on the keyboard so you can hear the differences. I want a bit of LFO, but not too much. And probably halfway through on the pulse width. I think the sub oscillator and maximum is probably too much. It will vibrate too much, so let's put it somewhere to 50%. Then let's have the VCA voltage control, uh, voltage control amplitude to set to uh, envelope. Here we go. Let's raise the attack Y high, something like that. Also the DK, similar, and let's give it a plant, plenty of release. Sounds already like a pad. So let's get uh, the envelope to influence also the VCF. A bit of modulation there as well. From the LFO. Let's move down the frequency to something like that, the cutoff. Let's decrease the rate of the LFO, is too quick. Okay, let's give it a bit of resonance. Then I like to compensate the cutoff here with a high uh, with pass filter as well, so that it will make it a little bit thinner on the low frequency, probably something like that. Okay, let's enable the chorus two. And I think, I think that's it, let's try it. Wow, so 
uh, as you can see, is very straightforward to create uh, a patch using uh, Taliuna LX, this wonderf wonderful um, app. Um, and you can continue like this, uh, probably a little bit more high pass filter. I will probably add a little bit of the delay coming in for the LFO, so it will not kick in straight away. Almost an angelic <laughs> um, pad, a little bit more of the sub oscillator. Let's go up an octave, so let's scroll, something like that, and let's try. sounds quite good to me so i hope you enjoyed a quick short tutorial uh, hopefully this will give you some of the basics on how uh, to create a patch remember always to uh, also max your poly particularly when you are on a pad uh, patch i hope you enjoyed and see you next time bye